What's up guys, it's Alina and today it is a little bit later in the afternoon. It is currently two o'clock. I decided that I was gonna do like, I guess like an afternoon in my life. Um, I'm kind of on a little bit of a time crunch. I do have to get ready because I do have to leave, but I have to eat. So I'm gonna be cooking. I'm gonna be making mac and cheese for the first time ever on the stove. I've never done it before. So I'm gonna be making this vegetables and loaded baked well not baked microwave potatoes um so i'm gonna be cooking that and then i have to get ready i have to do my makeup i'm a little bit concerned about how this is gonna go um certain things they just don't cook well i only have like one burner and it's not really like a good burner um so let's see but while that's boiling, I think I'm going to figure out what I'm going to wear. Um, I'm going to be going to... So I'm in the school of ministry at um, this place of worship that I go to that is called Resting Place. Um, I'm doing the prophetic track. I'll talk like a little bit more about that later. But basically today is family day. Um, so we're going to all be meeting just to like hang out, meet new people, talk to each other. Um, so I have to figure out what I'm going to wear. So I think that I have figured out what I'm going to wear. Um, I'm just going to go... I think I can do a bucket hat today too. I wore a variation of this outfit the other day. Um, I went to a concert. So I think I'm just going to do something. It's like cooler outside. So I'm just going <laughs> to... Give me a second. My, my room is a little bit of a mess. All right, so I just have like this plain gray crew neck. I have these black mom jeans. These are from Shein. Both of these are from Shein. And then I think I'm gonna wear these shoes. Um, but as I was saying, I think I might be able to also wear a bucket hat. Um, so we'll see about that. So this is the fit. I feel like I don't really like this bucket hat. It looks a little bit too big. Um, I'm used to having like I don't know my braids are usually bigger than what they are this time so this hat usually fits like perfect but right now it looks a little bit too big so i think i'm just gonna do my makeup and like do something cute with my hair i brought milk for this occasion because i only have oat milk um and the oat milk that i have is vanilla flavored and i didn't think that vanilla with cheese was going to go together very well so i had to get regular two percent milk i really hope that this tastes good whoa whoa not the fog sorry all right, I think that that's a better angle. I should have put it in there earlier. So I already put the milk in there. I kind of just had to estimate because I don't have a cup. Um, now we're just going to put this and see how it goes. These are the vegetables that I use. They're from Target. I just get the broccoli, cauliflower, and carrot blend. Alright, so my vegetables are done. I'm just going to be adding whoop, just gonna be adding some salt, pepper, and butter, and then that will be it. And then I'm gonna get into my next thing. I am literally so excited about this food. I can't even begin to explain. I'm watching La Reina del Flow. I don't know if you guys have heard about this show. If you haven't watched this on Netflix, best show ever. Um, this looks really delicious. I am surprised with myself. Um, so I just finished cleaning up. I decided that I'm going to refresh my edges. Um, I don't know if you guys can still, still hear me. But I decided that I was gonna refresh my edges um, just because they were looking a little, they were looking a little dusty. This is the gel that I have been using. It is the Style Factor Edge Booster Strong Cold Water Based Pomade. 
um this is honestly amazing for a really really long time i wasn't able to find any products that would hold my edges down all day i used to use the murray's the murray's edge wax and that works but it was also just like really really thick um so my edges were kind of like thinning out a little bit i guess because it was just a little bit too heavy so this is water-based it's amazing my edges usually stay down all day i was just sweating a little bit at my job so i'm gonna wait like five to ten minutes i really want to study before i leave because i also have to i have a chemistry exam um this week so it's currently 3:23. It'll probably only take me like 20 minutes to do my makeup, maybe less than that, honestly, because I already have my eyebrows and my eyelashes done. So it'll probably take me like 15 minutes actually, and I should be able to, I should be able to study before I leave, hopefully. Wait, so essentially, before I start doing my makeup, I'm just gonna do a light cleanse. I always, always do this, especially if I was wearing a mask, but I always do this, like if I don't put my makeup on right away in the morning and I do it later in the day, um, I wanna make sure that my face has a clean, I'm gonna take these off. I wanna make sure that it has a clean base um, because the oils on my face have already come out at this point in the day. It is 3.30, so these pimples. I really want to get a Hydra facial. I found someone here in Jersey that does them for relatively cheap. Um, so hopefully at some point in the next few weeks, I will be getting one of those. But I have like a lot of dark spots of pimples that I didn't even pop. Um, they're just dark spots. And that's very stressful. So then I'm just going to moisturize my face and then go on with the primer. And then that's it. I'll just go on with my regular routine. Honestly, doing my makeup midday is not my favorite. I really prefer to do it like in the morning when my face is like fresh because this definitely doesn't do what it needs to do. My makeup doesn't look, it looks good, but not like as good as it would have if I would have done it like in the morning. Bro, I think the mac and cheese is about to send me to the bathroom. I don't think I'm ever going to use regular milk again. I'm not lactose intolerant either, but I can feel that it is it is coming down and that's not good. I'm about to go to a public space where I'm not going to be able to go. So I do have I'm not going to like talk too much during this about like the actual products that I'm using. By the time this video goes up, I will have like another I will have like my makeup routine up on my channel. So if you're curious about what products I'm using, you can just go you can go watch that video and you'll know what I'm using. Basically, um, the School of Ministry, I'm getting, what is the word, like, capacitated? Is that a word? Um, in the area of prophecy and that's something that I'm very, very excited about. I am called to uh, prophesy and do prophetic worship. Um, that's something that has been spoken over me so i really just felt encouraged and pushed this semester um to challenge myself in doing the school of ministry which is something that i've never done before i've never done any type of like additional capacitation for um church or ministry or anything like that this is the first time that i've done anything like this um so this is like only like the second or third week and i've already learned so much about like prophesying and many 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 other things so i'm just excited to see um what the lord is going to continue to do i honestly think that it's time for me to get like new products like i will really use products until the very very end and i don't know if they like expire or whatever they probably do i have no idea how long i've had this but anyways there's a lot of people that i haven't met yet a lot of people that i haven't talked to so today is going to be the day for us to kind of just connect with some more people it's usually sunday monday um sunday is the actual prophecy class and monday everybody because there's like a lot of different tracks so everybody together we all do um the prayer class so um tomorrow tomorrow sunday i might have prophecy class regardless of like it being a little bit challenging it has definitely been worth it um so yeah for my regular school my college um i will be graduating very very soon it's currently march and i'm graduating in may so i'm so excited i am almost 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 at the end it's been a little bit stressful i'm not gonna lie because i don't know if you guys have ever had that like if you're a senior 
or if you've been a senior before but kind of when you're like at the end of the race you start to get kind of tired and so that's kind of like where i i am at like i've been having a little bit of difficulty just like staying motivated um but it is what it is you know i'm really really doing my best i have a's in all of my classes thus far except for chemistry chemistry is always problematic um but yeah so next week i actually have my senior pictures those will be coming soon um it's just the ones at the school not like anything else than that but and um i don't know i'm also turning 21 in a month like there's just so much stuff going on i'm so excited um i can't believe that i am going to be turning 21 years old it's literally beyond me i was thinking that i was gonna have time to study but for some reason i was thinking okay i'm gonna study from 4 30 to 5 but i have to be at the place at church at 5 so i don't know where my math went wrong but um i guess that's gonna have to wait until i get back i think i'm gonna come back like around 9 um so when i get back i'll just review some of my notes <sighs> i really have to poop oh my god who told me that this was a good idea? It was really good though. The food was really good. Me after favorito es dormir. Okay, we'll see how this how this turns out. I just feel like the vibe, I just need to wear a bun. So let's see how this goes. I think I started off good. One. Oh no, I don't think that's gonna work. That's not gonna work. We're gonna have to try that again. The bun is definitely not working. I don't know why it looks like a beehive. Um, so I'm just going to. I'm just gonna do a ponytail. All right. So I was going to put more product in my hair, but it's it's not necessary if it's gonna be in a ponytail. Um, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and like start ending the vlog. I don't want to record the family event just because like a lot of those people I don't know them. I've never spoken to them, so I don't want to like make anyone uncomfortable. And it's even uncomfortable for me <laughs> to be walking around with a camera. Um, so yeah, guys, look at my rings. This one is from Claire's. Um, we'll see how long that lasts. It's the first time. It's the first time that I bought a bracelet from Cla uh, rings from Claire's. I think that they'll last a little bit longer than the ones from Shein, but there we go. All right. Decked all the way out. Look at that. We got the rings, Pandora bracelet, necklace. Um, What scent should I convey today? Do I want to make these men fall in love with me? Yes, I do. This is the Irresistible by Givenchy. This is like one of my favorite, favorite, favorite perfumes of all time. I didn't put aquaphor on my lips. That's embarrassing. ¿Y quién cocinó todo eso? ¿En qué restaurante usted está? Do you hear her? ¿A dónde usted cocinó todo eso? ¿O ya está lista para casarse? ¿Cuál de las dos? all right so i think that's it um i want to do kind of like a final fit check but i don't know if it's gonna work out very well i don't have very much space in this room soon i'll be able to move this heater and this won't be an issue anymore the weather is already like nice outside so oh my gosh this is so bad okay so this is it got the ponytail forces okay so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video i know that it was kind of like more chill um i just want to thank you guys so much for watching this video if you did enjoy it please make sure to give it a thumbs up comment down below what types of videos you guys want to see next and subscribe to my channel subscribe is down below along with all of my social media links my instagram my twitter my tiktok please make sure you follow me on tiktok i also have a spotify and i have a shop on etsy that i am selling digital downloads so you guys can also check that out in the description so i'll see you guys next week ya yo no retrocedo, en Cristo todo lo puedo Y nada me va a hacer cambiar, aunque digan que soy muy anormal Aquí no le vamos a bajar